a good practice, not uh, the same intensity that we enjoyed on Saturday. And that's what the message was at the end of the practice, that we have to, uh, can't just survive these spring uh, chances. We've got to go out there and we've got to bust our tails. And, and I'm going to expect a heck of a lot more tomorrow where we're going to uh, get into a situational scrimmage and, and have some fun doing it. But uh, we've got to uh, just keep improving. And that requires great leadership and everybody uh, understanding exactly what's required of everybody when they come out here. So hopefully we'll get better tomorrow. I know we will. Questions? Uh, will there be any discipline with Cassius? Uh, that'll be internal. Uh, it's just growing pains. What was Fourier kind of doing out there? It seemed like a lot of guys were getting a little... I wasn't at the drill, Chris. I don't know. I have to watch on film. But uh, I just know uh, there was a lot of frustration and growing pains. We'll get, we'll get through it. Have you talked to him yet? No, I'll talk to him after. You just want a multi, you want multiple snap counts. You don't want to give the defense a head start. You want to make sure, and we're trying to get through that, and obviously uh, there's growing pains associated with that too. Guys having to remain, remember what the count is, not jumping off sides. But if you're going to be good at anything, you got to practice it, and so we've got to just uh, go through that. How's Stan? He's doing better. He's doing better. Just, you know, like most of the younger players, inexperienced players, looking for consistency. And uh, But I'm excited about what Stan can bring to us. Is it good to see him working as one of the peacemakers? I wasn't there. You, 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 I'm, I'm assuming he was. That, yeah, that's a good thing. That's, that's, that's a move in the right direction. The lack of intensity, is that growing pains as well today from Saturday? Uh, I don't know that it was lack of intensity as much as it was lack of concentration. And then it, it just kind of gets into a little bit of mush. But, uh, you know, there's there's days when you feel more like playing than others. But you have to have the f mental fortitude to fight through that and, and really get yourself going. And, and that's what guys do for each other. That's They pick each other up and get, give each other a reason to get motivated and going. And that's what we have to learn how to do. You didn't like Richard Brio had a good day. He was making some, making some throws. Would you say, how would you say he did I, th I thought he had a good day. You know, uh, he's a good football player. He just has that, that just that breakdown uh, mentally that ends up being an atrocious decision I, I keep going where does that come from and the only the only answer to that is he's predetermining and so we've got to keep finding out that out so that we can get him off of that and, and make sure that he's taking what the defense gives him and not guessing did anybody show leadership to try to pick up the practice oh yeah there's a number of guys that are doing that I just need more and it's as the head coach it's my job to tell him it wasn't as good as Saturday and we got to be better and so uh, I expect them, just as I expected them on Saturday to come out with a great urgency, I expect it tomorrow. I think we'll have a hell of a practice tomorrow. Can you talk about Morrell? It seems like you rejuvenated a bit this spring. You know, it's an important year for Morrell. He wants to uh, become a you know a pivotal player for us, and, and we found some places for him to play within uh, our scheme as a tight end, you know, which is what he was recruited to do. And he's worked hard to gain some weight to be able to handle that position, especially at the point of attack. So. So there's a learning curve. Last year he was just only a motion guy. This year we're going to have his hand down a few times, and we just need him to be able to handle that. And uh, he's going to have to, to uh, you know, buy into it. And he has, and he's been great. So uh, I'm excited for him. A week ago you said you wanted to have the chemistry well-oiled by today. Well, I think our guys understand what, what we're trying to get accomplished. I think our guys are working hard to uh, – uh, to get better. I just think we can't allow it to just survive a practice. And today was more of a that kind of day rather than an urgency to get better. And, and uh, again, it's players that help each other get that accomplished. Everybody good? All right, thanks.